OK, thanks, Keith. <laughs> I don't know if I'll take the whole time or not, so we'll um, see how we do. So I'm going to talk about um, what we've been doing uh, in terms of uh, trying to get the word out about the foundation uh, and uh, some of the activities that we have coming up for next year. Now we keep, you know, we keep hearing about this. Our goal is users, more users, and even more users, uh, and that's actually what we we have to really be pushing now. I mean, I think the platform is at a, at a great place. The new things I, I, I and I'm sure will be even better, but where we are today is that it's it's time to really get more people using the system and, and really pushing ahead. And when you get more users, that means more money. Now. Not exactly in the way I'm used to in terms of commercial software because we're open source, we're not for profit, so that's that's not exactly right. But what we're looking for is to get more members um, who will join the, the society and help us, this foundation, to help us do things like this event, uh, more sponsors so that we can you know continue to maybe have this uh, without having a fee. Uh, but most importantly, expanding the community. It's really about getting more people to know about the platform and can use it in their research and, and really getting that, that word out. And that's really what you know, my focus has been on, how can we do that uh, as best we can. So I'm gonna talk about a bunch of things and I'll just go through this list um, pretty quickly. Uh, hopefully a lot of this is not gonna be new to you because you are already using some of these things. So the first thing we started out was, was rebranding re uh, the foundation. We, we had a logo and you know, I think there was, you know, we knew kind of where we were, but the, the thought was that, you know, we've got the same goals, we have the same mission, but really what we wanted to do was just give us a fresh look to make it feel like, you know, 1.2 was coming and we really are, you know, kind of getting that, that next step in the, the movement of the, of the foundation. And so uh, you've seen these now, we've got new logos for the foundation uh, that we use and with a new logo for the platform. If anybody's giving a presentation or you know, uh, making materials, Feel free to use these if you don't. I, I don't have them actually on the website, but I will put a download uh, piece on the website shortly so that you can please make use of these. I'll put the, uh, the presentation templates on. Uh, so anybody is please more than welcome to use these uh, in your materials. Uh, so, and I encourage you to do that. And if you don't and I see it, you'll get an email from me. So please, uh, please try to use them. Uh, you'll notice that Ken used the old logo. Ken Kubota used the old logo the first night and the next day he had the new logo in. That was my email. So. <clears throat> We've also done uh, a new website. So we had a creative team, uh, a contractor we work with to really help put together the, the new website. It's got a, a new look and feel. Uh, and uh, it's a, a whole uh, template with a lot of capabilities. You'll see more and more stuff uh, coming on here. But, you know, the, the banner across the top and, you know, Keith or, or one of the management team or even one of you will continue to have like a news story that will keep coming. Uh, we're trying to keep the news events in here uh, and lots of you know, uh, upcoming events uh, all loaded on here. I, I try to be really active and aggressive about keeping stuff on here. We've got a blog now running uh, and you know, if, you, if you see things that are interesting that you think should be on here, please let me know. Uh, there's a, um, go backwards, at the top there, there's a, a contact us button. Uh, we get that, you know, and we we uh, we can put you know things on here that you think should be here. This is a communication vehicle for us to talk to each other and get information out. Uh, and so, please feel free to you know drop me a note and let me know what you're uh, interested in. Uh, we are tracking the usage, and so our usage has definitely gone up from where it was. So we got about 40 new users over the last couple of weeks. Obviously, thanks to this meeting, we've got, we've jumped up. You know, so it's not. Not huge, but considering you know there's uh, you know 100, 130 people here, getting 40 people kind of a day uh, in the system is, is pretty good, and you know all kind of demographics are interested in it. Uh, so we are tracking this and, and kind of keeping you know a view. Uh, we've been sending a lot of emails out over the last couple of months, and so I you know every time something new came up, we would shoot a new email that had you know this information, and then the next day you get another email from us, and I, I hate getting email like that, and so. What we've decided is to pre put together was essentially a newsletter. We call it our News Blast. Uh, we're trying to gather all the in information and try to only send this out to you uh, every other week, maybe we'll, we'll, you know, once a month as we need you know, to do it, but not making it too crazy and too much stuff. But within it, you know, we, we have, you know, have messages as we need them, upcoming events highlighted, and then links to all the, the relevant information. So hopefully you know, you're getting this uh, if you're not uh, if you haven't, if this is new to you and you haven't gotten it, again, drop us a note. 
Uh, this is a mailing list of about 400 people. It came off of what we were using in our Google lists, so hopefully everybody here's on it. Uh, I do check, and so those of you who aren't on it who are registered, I will put you on, so we'll, uh, we'll keep track of that. If you have friends who, oh, absolutely, absolutely. <laughs> right. Yeah, so, you know, let's, um, you know, this is how, this is a good way to, to grow people's awareness, certainly. Uh, and we're also implementing, we, we have, with the new website, there's a whole email management system that you can opt in and opt out and all this jazz. And so, you know, you'll be able, we'll be able to get this, uh, keep this really, hopefully, clean and up to date. So please let me know uh, about that. And the other thing now is what, right? Mm -hmm. Yeah, I mean, we, we can, you know, it's, it's, uh, it's a little hard for editing purposes, right, to do that, but, but if we, you know, you can send things to us and we can, we'll, we'll certainly get them included in, absolutely. <clears throat> yeah. Yeah, absolutely. I mean, we're, we're trying to, you know, first of all, have enough information that makes people want to come back to this. But, you know, my hope has been that, you know, you'll start to see things here and say, wait a minute, let, how about this or how about that and send stuff to us. So and I'll, I'll actually talk about that a little bit more in a minute. OK, so the next step is to, in, you know, getting out and more on the social media and, and doing some things with that. Um, you may or not may or may not know that we have a, a YouTube channel, uh, which we've been working with. and. Uh, what I've got uh, is a set of playlists, and so I have a playlist for our version 1.2 tutorials, um, which is pretty light right now, but this will grow. We have all the 2014 community meeting recordings uh, here, uh, tutorials from 1.1 and earlier uh, here, and uh, even the Paris meeting, a lot of the, the content there. And so we're trying to get you know these put up here. Uh, we will use Lanyard, but I think there's also some value to having it you know posted here as well. So we'll continue to do that. Okay. Um, other social media activities. We do have a uh, LinkedIn group. Uh, there are over 500, 530, 540 people on the LinkedIn group. If you use LinkedIn and you're not, you're not on our group, please join. Right? Just it's Transmart Foundation group. It's pretty hard. Uh, you can get, you know, get on our mailing list on the list here. Um, I do know that when I put something up on here, within a day or two, over 250 people read them. So this gets read. There's, there's no doubt. And so. When I post something on the website in a blog, I will cross post it here so that you can, you can see it. Um, similarly, we have a, a Twitter site. It's transmar underscore org is our, our Twitter name. Uh, I post things on here. Uh, we have 140 people. This was under 100 uh, not too long ago, so this is growing. Uh, I've posted, you know, this is from yesterday, from Ken's talk last night. The, the, when you click it, it looks better. <laughs> it's, it's, it's kind of clipped a little bit there, but. We, we're trying to post things, and thank you for you know a lot of you K's and a lot of people are retweeting these things as you see them. So please, um, you continue to look at that, and we'll try to keep that uh, again rolling. Uh, but you know we're up to 140 followers, which is um, you know good start, to get moving. Um, <clears throat> one of the places you could really help us is that we we have a section on the website for presentations and publications, uh, and it's it's pretty sad to look at that list, because I know we've got a lot more publications than what are listed here. Um, and yet, you know, we, we really need to, to try to get, you know, a part of what we're doing, you know, is that, that the scientific references are so important to let people know what people are doing with the, the platform. And um, if you go to the, to the um, presentations piece, right, we have, I mean, any new things, I'm keeping up to date, right? And so, uh, I'm trying to, you know, as we get invited to talks from the management team, I put them on here. But as, you know, if you have a presentation you're giving, if you see a presentation at a conference that looks cool, new or old, right, we can put it up. Uh, in this case, you know, some of the older ones, we actually put the links in if they have a video or a link to the actual talk. So, you know, anything like that you have, I'd really like to keep this really up to date and, you know, a, a good place to come as a reference to, you know, what have people done with, with the foundation? You know, what kind of presentations have they given? Brian, I'm linked into your secretary, so she's feeding me this stuff. <laughs> yeah? Yeah. Right. 
Right. Yep. Publications or even, you know, I've got even fewer publications here, and so this is another, again a place where it'd be really helpful. I, I know, I know. So even on the website I have, if you just see a single publication and you know, you know, even if you, if you give me an author name and a journal name or something, I'll go track it down if I, you know, if, if that's all you got. But I've tried to put this so that, you know, you can enter the stuff and let me know, you know, what you see. <clears throat> okay, so, you know, we're really trying to, to beef up, you know, our presence uh, on the web, our presence in the social media and, you know, get people, you know, talking about us more and, and you know, just seeing what, what people are actually doing. Uh, the last thing is conferences. So we have not had much presence at any conferences. We haven't had the money to do it, frankly. Um, with our current membership levels, however, you know, we are planning to, to do, increase our activities. So we, we did have a presence at BioIT World this past, during this year in, in, uh, in April, May. Um, but we had a workshop before the meeting, but we didn't have a booth or anything. So we had a nice workshop. We had a wonderful um, uh, evening at Deloitte for a community meeting. Uh, but during the show itself, we really were, were not very well present, although there were five talks at BioIT World about Transmart, which is, which is pretty good. One of them, I think Michael gave one about the, the foundation, and then the, the other four were just about scientific presentations using the platform itself. And so I thought we should really get you know, a little more presence there. And so uh, I've picked two conferences for us to, to attend this year. Uh, the first one is the Tricon Molecular Medicine Conference uh, in San Francisco, which is in February. And I picked this one, I, I've been to this one a number of times myself. Uh, I, I find this as an interesting conference because if you look at the, the different topics, right, it's, it's really focused on uh, a lot more of the science, uh, both research and clinical side. There's, there's a few IT tracks, you know, some uh, integrated IT, uh, integrated pharma informatics, um, but there's a translational uh, to clinical R&D, you know, track. So there's some interesting tracks here that I think are, are kind of useful. Um, Keith and I have been talking, maybe you know, trying to get some a presentation here or not. Uh, it's very hard for us as the foundation to get a presentation at these conferences because they look at us as a, another vendor, and they really are looking for scientific talks, They're looking for talks you know that really have you know um, a much more you know meat to them uh, from what we can than just hearing about the foundation. So it's hard for us to actually get on the podium at these things, and so you have a different you know you have a, a better chance of doing that, but. You know, for us to get, um, you know, to be there and have a booth, this is what we're trying to do. So we will have a small booth here at this. You know, we'll, we'll have, uh, you know, maybe some of the, the vendors would like to participate with us and we can, you know, work on that if, if you're not going to be there. So uh, for that one. And then uh, and the other thing is, you know, this conference does have, you know, it's got a 20-year history. They get, you know, 3,000 attendees, you know, at this meeting. And so it's, it's actually a good, good place to get some visibility. And it's a different group than what we usually talk to. Uh, BioIT world is more, you know, the, the IT side of the world, and, you know, again, you know, several thousand uh, attendees come to this. Uh, I think this is a really well-targeted, you know, group. Uh, we do have, you know, th there's a lot of tracks here that are, you know, quite interesting, and we could actually fit into one of these. But again, for us to go and talk, you know, they're, they're really not that excited. Now, we've talked to the management at BioIT about the Michael J. Fox work and, you know, some of the, the questions about, you know, the things that we talked about earlier, you know, about doing, you know, a project ahead of time. They're very interested in that. And so we might be able to get, you know, our own session here and talking about the Michael J. Fox initiative, bringing their data to the, the platform. Um, you know, then their, their ears perked up and they're, they're quite interested. So we'll see, you know, see how we can work that out. But that's, that's been the, the goal there. So you'll see us at both of these conferences. We'll have a very small, modest booth, but it'll look, it'll look good. And uh, I think, you know, it'll be a, a place for us to really start talking you know, directly to the, to the people coming to these things and uh, actually participating. Okay, so that's, um, you know, that's what we've got planned. Uh, the question is, you know, where else should we be going, right? Is, is you know, ISMB a good place to, to, for us to participate? You know, I'd love to find a, a European conference that we can have a, a small presence at possibly, you know, if there, there's something that makes sense. Um, is it? Oh, that's right, yeah, we talked about that. Yeah. Yeah. Yep. Yeah. I mean, I think we we might be able to afford one more, right, with the budget we have. Um, and the question is, 
what would we do? You know, what would be a, a good recommended place? So. Mm -hmm. Yeah, absolutely. Yeah, well, that, well, that's my last. That's my last question here: is where are you guys going this during 2015? And you know, are there a place that you know we might want to be able to do something? You know, that that makes sense. Okay, so that's um, that's really what I wanted to talk about. Down to the end. So, anybody have any questions or comments? Be happy to answer. Unless it's Julie, then. Oh. effort goes into marketing and putting these things together everything looks pretty in that but there's a ton of work behind it i know because i've been there um so rudy fabulous job sure. thank you I gotta, I gotta say that you know i've just enjoyed working with rudy so much you're fantastic i mean it was such a good uh, thing to bring rudy in He's, you know, with Kevin and Rudy, I mean, this conference uh, became available to us because of those guys. Rudy and Kevin deserve a big hand. You guys did great. Thank you, Kevin. Yeah. And, the, and Jackie, of course. She's a math mistress of ceremonies. I have but, to say, uh, the, the Michigan team made this so much easier. I've, I've done these before, and this is, you know, you guys. Yeah, we've well, been doing these meetings for a while. Yeah. It really.